man. Calling you because your mama was worried about you because she thought your Honda was gonna be up in the air. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, right? Oh my god. <laughs> What's up, guys? Welcome back to my channel. So today well let me just start with what i wanted today to be today what i wanted to do was get up fairly early get something to cook and head to a trail and cook using my camping stove because i've never used it i'm actually a little terrified of it i'm not gonna lie i probably bought it in june of last year and i've never used it not once um how do i survive you may ask turkey sandwiches <laughs> but today <laughs> today we're growing up possibly the conflict is that it rained all day today it really just stopped raining not too long ago so i got a pretty late start to my day it's about five o'clock i think the sun sets around 7 30 so i'm gonna go to the store grab something that i can cook which i don't even know what to get because i'm not about to chef up a meal on my first use i'm not about to do that i'm actually a little terrified of it i'm not gonna lie i really might just get some ramen like i like the asian spicy ramen noodles i don't know what they're called but i might get that and maybe some broccoli and like chef up some ramen but i'm not cooking a five course meal so yeah that's what i would like to do if that doesn't happen well y'all gonna be hanging with me regardless but if that doesn't happen then we just gonna kick it in the van and watch movies and y'all know chill like <laughs> what you gotta do <laughs> i'm sorry i'm sorry i know y'all have a life yeah let's just start by going to the store bye just in case y'all can't see me. So it's only six o'clock and it's pretty much dark. I think the trails close at nightfall. I'm gonna drive over there and check it out. I'm not that worried about it being too, too dark because I have my own lights. But if it's just like too dark, you know what I mean? Like creepy dark, then I'm not gonna do it. All right, I'm gonna use this. I ended up just coming and parking back at my sister's house because it was just too dark. I didn't want no problems. I don't want no problems. This is the camping stove. Wait, because where do the flames come from? I feel like the flames can come. I'll show y'all in a second. I got to figure out what I'm going to cook on. Because that just doesn't feel safe. I don't know what to cook on. Anyways, let me get the propane. Now, in hindsight, I probably shouldn't have threw away the instructions. And I feel like I didn't. I feel like I didn't. I feel like I'm smarter than that. But ask me if I know where I put them. I see y'all using these. So I'm gonna just assume it ain't that big of a deal. And I see plenty of van lifers cook inside their van. test my carbon monoxide detector okay we're working okay so i think i'm finally ready to start cooking i couldn't find a surface to cook it on i didn't realize that the camp stove was this long but anyways i went inside my sister house thank god i'm doing it here and i got this wooden table so let's get to cooking <clears throat> now is not the time for clumsiness. Oh, you are in as far as you can go. It's just the sliding that's like making me really nervous. I'm just gonna be uber careful. Okay. It doesn't seem as if I have to screw or do anything. So I'm assuming I just take this little thing and stick it up in here. Maybe I put them 
Oh my God. See, I know me. I know me. Make sure the regulator is securely fastened to the burner. I did. I did that really, really tight. <laughs> she ain't going nowhere. Make sure all the knobs are off. You would think that I would have checked that. Remove manufacturing oils before. Hey. What's this? I will utilize it. Love you. <laughs> Y'all, like when I tell y'all, I don't even like using gas stoves. I don't like using gas stoves. Why do I have to repeat everything twice? We're going for it, y'all. I'm doing it. All right, so we're going to go ahead and put some water in. Oh my God. This ain't that big of a deal, but it's a big deal to me. Look at it, look at it go. No big deal, full-time van lifer, whatever. So we have our noodles. Let me actually add the broccoli first. Turn it down a little bit. Maybe it was never that serious. <laughs> it's getting hot. But like, duh, you know. Let's go ahead and put the noodles in because I don't like my broccoli um, soft. So we're gonna go ahead and get the noodles in. I'm trying to be careful with how I move things because this is slippery. Let me crack this door. There's more water than I want it to be, but I'm gonna go ahead and add the sauce and get this all finished up. Off. Here's that. I personally like to add sesame oil to any and everything because I'm obsessed with sesame oil. A little bit goes a long way. These just need to be eaten. So we're gonna put them in there. Yay! Let's give this a stir. Oh, that sesame oil smells so good. Also have the roasted seaweed snack, just regular sea salt flavor. And then the cilantro lime shrimp. I'm excited, this is about to be good. Let me get this put up. This is my first meal in my van. Mm. Mm. Oceanic. up there gotta build the perfect bite and then they show it to you like what's that gonna do i don't know <laughs> mm, mm -hmm. okay so i'm gonna go ahead and finish eating and then i'm gonna check back in with y'all I feel good. That was great. I'm happy I did it. I'm a lot less nervous about using it now. I knew once I did it, it would just be like whatever because people just be whipping them out on all the YouTube channels. So I already knew it was going to be a big deal. And it wasn't. Also, I just want to say thank you to everyone who has subscribed. Like, stop. <laughs> Me? Me? <gasps> I've officially been in my minivan for a year now. I moved into my minivan last January. Oh my God, I've been doing this for a year. I don't know why I keep forgetting that. Wow. And there's no better way to bring it in than using my camping stove, finally. One year down and I don't even know how many more years to go. I don't see me settling down anytime soon. I can't fathom it. Cause if I'm not traveling in my van, I'm gonna be traveling internationally or, or what, there ain't nowhere else to go. I'm not going on the water. Anywho, I'm full, I'm feeling good and I'm finna go.